Hey guys, um, just want to make a little video to give you guys a tour of my place. Um, show you guys what I pretty much pay $1,700 a month for. Kind of gross. But anyways, just wanted to give you an idea about me and kind of where I work on my cosplays. And that way you guys can get to know me a little bit better. So here we go. So starting off in the bedroom with the dresser, you've got my favorite Wonder Woman ring. And then we move this way into my walk-in closet that I've converted into the Legion of Cute headquarters. Um, up here you've got all of my Funkos and some of my toys that I've gotten. Um, this is a mixture of stuff that I've either gotten at conventions or stuff that you guys have actually sent me. I'm kind of short so I have to like reach it up here. Um, so it's a really big kind of collection of some of my favorite stuff. Um, to be honest, you know, I, I kind of like to have a little bit of quiet alone time sometimes and so I'll come in here and close the door and um, take this time to kind of figure, figure out what I want to do with uh, my next cosplays. And here you have the cosplay shoes and some of my wigs, um, my tricorder. Down here you've actually got this whole container down here is full of wigs. Um, and then I've got some of my costumes hanging up here, all of my badges from different conventions that I've gone to. Um, and then over here is all of my costumes. I'm a little bit OCD, so they're all kind of in these boxes and they're all labeled and there's a few uh, in each box, but it kind of helps me keep them all together. and. Um, yeah, I'm a bit OCD. So, <laughs> um, coming out of the bedroom. You guys don't want to see the bathroom. It's a little bit messy. And then, so we'll come in here. And here's the bookshelf with more Funkos and some of my video games. And then you keep going up. And there's the board game collection. Um, just to let you guys know, Lord of the Rings, the card game, is ridiculously difficult. I don't even know how you're supposed to stay alive yet in that. Um, the Doctor Who card game at the very top is tons of fun. I totally recommend that for anyone um, who really likes Doctor Who. It's really fun. Um, and then you come over here and you've got like the little workout station. Um, let's see got the TV and then here's my view of the lovely parking lot across the street also the office building that I like to spy on with my binoculars though nothing fun ever happens maybe one day I'll find something fun happening and then if you look down there nine stories down you see the cars um, going by that's always kind of cool especially on rainy days and then you come up here, and there's my mannequin with my Catwoman top getting done over there. Then you move over to this space, and here's my kitchen. I do actually really like to cook, so uh, this is a good little space for me to be able to cook. This is pretty much where I sit when I answer all of your guys' messages and work things out on on uh, Facebook and then you come to this oh there's Cloud here's my my cat Cloud he's uh, not looking too amused at the moment but ow okay yeah see that's not his that's his not amused face um, and so here is my video collection which there's actually a ton more back behind these I'm a huge movie buff. I love watching movies and TV shows, primarily because I put them on um, in the background whenever I'm working on cosplays. Magic D20. And you come down here and there's tons of books, my D&D dice, um, a little dice caddy that I got at PAX East, more books, 
Then you come down here and there's even more books down here. Some of my comic book collections over here. There's a lot more in boxes. Uh, this gives you a little idea. And then you come over here and here's my favorite spot, my cosplay corner. So here's all my supplies, or at least some of them. And a sewing machine. Let me give you a, a good view of my cosplay work area. So you've got all of kind of the essentials here, pens and markers, business cards, um, general kind of uh, craft supplies, sewing supplies, paints, prosthetic ears and other stuff. Um, got a bunch of fabric down there and some more supplies, my spray paints, wig supplies. And then you move up. There's kind of my books and idea books that I have going on. My cat when he was a baby, when he wasn't trying to bite my hand. Um, Xbox cards from the 90s that I've been collecting. Some of the figures that you guys have gotten me that have really helped me out with being able to uh, be accurate with my cosplays. These are my exclusive Funkos and some more of my statues. But I just wanted to give you guys like an idea of kind of where I work on things and, and what my place looks like and that way, you know, hopefully you guys can get a better idea of who I am and what I do.